It's a new way to look at USF as researchers at the Alliance for Integrated Spatial Technologies, or AIST, are using three-dimensional imaging to create a virtual campus. Lots of people kind of say they have 3D campus maps, but they're not true 3D with the laser scanning. They're more like um, models that have been drawn and created to make them appear to be 3D. Researchers take 3D laser scans of USF buildings and combine them with high-resolution photos and other data to create a virtual world that can be used for purposes like security, management, even engaging potential students who want to visit the campus online. Well, you can do that in a 2D map or you can go to Google Earth. But in this way, we can do total immersion. We can, we can fly through the campus. We can take them into a building. In addition, buildings can be tagged with information that augments reality, something AIST has already done with Fort Matanzas, an 18th century Spanish fort near St. Augustine. Through your own device, through a phone or a tablet, once we tag that spot with information, we can then view things about that building. So the building can talk to us, the building can tell us its story. AIST has also worked at historic international sites, allowing students to experience the world without ever leaving Tampa. Some people have spent a whole lifetime mapping archaeological sites, and we can do that in a really rapid and a really accurate and representative way. We can bring that pyramid back to a classroom here at USF. For University Beats, I'm Mark Schreiner. For more information about AIST's work or to view previous segments, log on to WUSF.org and click on the University Beat link.